We smoke Tyson's. <laughs> it's good. I'm just. I'm Where do you buy it. your stuff from? Are you in like stores, dispensaries? Not yet. Uh, I got a product coming out called Uncle Snoop's product, which is the first actual product that I'm putting out that has my name, my likeness, my everything, my DNA all over it. Then I got my Bored Ape that I'm about to drop some bud with called Dr. Bombay. So I took my Bored Ape and created a brand for him, an uh, action figure, clothing line, all of the above, just trying to make him do what he's supposed to do because I'm watching the Bored Ape community like slowly but surely get off into traditional businesses. And, you know, that's what I, it's my expertise. How, how did you learn all this shit about NFTs? Because you're fucking, my son, fucking, you're my, son my son, Cordell, Cordell, Nick Adler. Um, well, mainly Nick was the first one that brought it to me. Nick was always pushing the, the line on doing this and doing that. And then Cordell started easing me into it by explaining it to me to where, you know, what, like we say in nigga terms, so I could understand it because Nick was talking in, technology terms and I couldn't really figure that shit out. So Cordell helped me understand it. Then we put a team of people behind us, which is Amador and Shiv. And then we got my regular team, which is Jasmine and Kevin, and just my inside team. We just began just moving and jumping into the field and learning and exploring and just figuring this shit out. And now that I'm actually hands on, I kind of like got it now. I like really got it figured out now. And that's what that's what Nick always wants. He always wants for me to to learn it myself. So that way when we ever having conversations, I don't look like yeah. a dummy when motherfuckers start asking questions. I know we met a lot of people that you can kind of tell they're yeah, just getting like, into oh, it because it's trendy yeah, and shit. Yeah, you're just saying some shit that somebody but, programmed. But you know, yeah, saying. you could tell when you speak about it, you're like educated on it. How cool is that that it's like a father-son type duo? That's, that's the pretty, dope. That's fire. That's the dope shit right there because, you know, naturally I want him to be a football star because that was my dream. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But at the there same was a show time, about that one, wasn't yeah, there? Definitely, Snoop and Son. But at the end of the day, it's about him having his own dreams and making his own path. And it just seemed like business was more important to him than sports. And how can I knock that when that's what we push in our family, to be the best at who we can be? And if business is what it is, then that's what it's supposed to be. And I support him. God is back. And now I'm taking lessons from him to show you that that's how we're supposed to be in life. If somebody can teach you something, no matter how old they are, what position they're in, you should be willing to listen. 